Hi, my name is Lisa Serkham. I'm the product specialist for biotech instruments at Millennium Science. Welcome to Lisa's List, a video on five tips to get the most out of your plate washer. My first tip is to use a detergent in your wash buffer, such as Tween 20. Why do you need a detergent? Detergents limit background staining by removing poorly bound substrates. The hydrophobic end of detergents also block any unbound conjugation sites, again preventing non-specific substrate binding. The concentration of detergents is also important and should be optimised for your experiments. Too much detergents can create an excess of bubbles, which may cause an overflow of your waste buffer. Thankfully, biotech plate washers can have a liquid level sensor fitted into the waste containers. Tip two, centers on aspiration. Again, add a detergent to your wash buffer, as this will make it easier to aspirate your wells. If you forego a detergent, you will need to increase your aspiration rate to help evacuate your well. For cell-based assays, I recommend reducing your aspiration rate to protect the monolayer integrity. The location of aspiration tubes should also be optimised based upon your plate type. For flat bottom well plates, optimal manifold tube location is as close as possible to the side of the well wall. For round bottom well plates, the centre of the well is the best location for the manifold tubes in order to assist with aspiration. Finally, always leave a residual volume in the plate. Never completely evacuate your wells, as this can denature your proteins or damage your cells. The biotech plate washers have two features that permit automation of cell-based assays. The first is angling of dispense tubes and the second is by reducing fluid flow. Angled dispense tubes adjust the fluid path to the side of the wall. Doing so reduces the vortex-like effect that liquid dispensing creates and this can be detrimental to the monolayer integrity. Here is an example of cells washed with straight dispense tubes and the benefit of angling these tubes to the cell layer. Altering fluid flow is another way to reduce the vortex-like effect that is created by dispensing. You can see here an example of the damage from using standard dispensing rates on cells in a 96 and 384 well plate respectively. Here you can see the benefit of altering the fluid path. Now some frequently asked questions. What is ultrasonic advantage? The ultrasonic advantage is the inbuilt cleaning system in the biotech plate washers. When the manifold tubes are in the metal reservoir, ultrasonic energy creates the repeated and violent implosion of bubbles within the cleaning liquid. And this in turn removes any stubborn buildup of salts and protein. Common cleaning fluids that you can use are deionized water, with the addition of a detergent such as Tween 20, or a commercial product like Turg Azyme, which contains a protease to help clean protein deposition. Finally, some miscellaneous tips. First, add a soak time when transitioning from a manual to automatic workflow. Automatic washing is more efficient, so adding a soak time can account for any lag that occurs with manual pipetting. Second, always prime the fluid path. Priming the fluid path should be done at least daily and repeated if you take a break between experiments. It's a quick two minute step that will ensure you maintain consistent results. The fluid path needs to always remain unobstructed. Tube blockages are the most common reason for assay failure and washer breakdown. And that is going to cost you time and money. Finally, yes, you can use milk-based products or protein-rich solutions in the washers. I just recommend using a protease in your maintenance routine. Thank you for watching this video. 
If you have any questions on the content within this video or anything biotech related, please reach out. My email is listed here. I have also created a list of washer definitions and terminology, a maintenance checklist, and visual abstract for applications of the biotech washers. If you would like any of these resources, please send me an email. Finally, if you would like to view any of the products that Millennium Science and Jomar Life Research supply, please refer to our websites here on the screen. Thank you again for watching this video on 5 tips to get the most out of your plate washer.